let's get started on the ham. I'm gonna make the best ham these judges have ever tasted. I cook hundreds of pounds of ham a week in the butcher shop, so we already understand how to make this moist. I'm gonna bone it out so I can get flavor all the way around. See how we separated it out? Now I'm gonna get all the fat off of it so that the rib will stick. That one's ready to be injected. We're gonna make a cured Christmas ham. It's a quick cure, salts, nitrates, a little brown sugar, nutmeg, and the cure accelerator. This is called sodium athorbate. Most cures take several days to work. We're gonna make this happen in two hours. So after I inject the cure in the ham, I'm gonna apply the honey rub. This is a honey-based rub of salt, onion powder, and garlic powder, sugar, paprika, and honey powder. I'm hoping to sweeten this. It'll melt down into the meat a little bit when it's being cooked. We are getting ready to prep this $50,000 ham. Ham is one of the first things I actually learned how to cook. I'm gonna take this hard skin off this ham. If we put anything on this skin, it's just gonna slide off. Ricky's gonna start injecting this thing. Our ham injection is brown sugar and apple juice. Not rubbing this fresh ham today because the injection adds that sweet element to it. Now, we're ready to go in the pit with this. This is a good looking ham. I do a lot of these at the restaurant. My strategy with these fresh hams, I wanna smoke one whole. I decided not to trim the skin and the fat off the fresh ham because it keeps the juices in, the fat kind of caramelizes and helps that meat get so tender. We're gonna put a little dry rub on it. The rub I'm using today is a simple rub that I always use. I use seasoned salt, I use lemon pepper, and I use a little garlic salt. That's pretty much it. It's got me through the first round, and here I am in the semifinal round. With my second fresh ham, I'm gonna core it. This just gives us more options. Nice piece there. Nice piece nice there. Piece. Nice. And then we're just gonna dry rub it up. Like with the whole ham, it's enough meat on these. Let's put these on. Let's do it. We only gave our pit masters today 10 hours. You know, that's really not much time at all with these fresh hams. I agree with that. After I get my injection done, get the rub on, it's going on my smoke at 325 degrees. I'm gonna put it on the pit at about 300 degrees, and then I'm gonna cook it till it gets to about 185 degrees, somewhere in there. I really like to hang out about that 235 to 250 degree mark. I'm gonna let that ham get as much smoke as I can for the first two or three hours, and then I'm gonna wrap it up pretty quickly.